Hey everybody, it's Gary the Google Guy here with a new update for Google Calendar. You can now use color categorization in your Google Calendar to better understand how you're spending your time. So essentially you'll be using labels. So to get started with that, you can go to any of your events, right click, and at the bottom part you'll see an area here in our menu with a plus symbol to add a label. So this one's my weekly project management meeting. So I think what I might do is create a new label for that. Now it's going to pop this dialog box up and from here you'll see I've already got a few that are already created. I can click my plus symbol and add a new label and color. And how about we do blueberry and let's add this to project meetings. So we'll type in that and then we'll click on save and then I can go back to that exact same event label it with project and I can edit whether it's this event following events we'll just do this one for now and now I've color coded that visually to see what that is going to be about you can also do this upon creation of events go back in time and whatnot there now what this connects to is to the left of our screen our time insights if we click on that little pull down arrow You'll see a little bit of a color bar there. More insights pops out our window to the right side of the screen. Now you'll see here a time breakdown of how are you using your time by type or by color. So if we click on by type, you'll see that we can look at our focus time and those different things that maybe we're all about in terms of the types of meetings that we are in. Or if you've color coded them, you can go by color and then you'll see what are those different color bars showing in terms of how are you spending your time connected to your calendar view there. Now you can also click that pencil icon in the upper right, bring up that same dialog box to edit your labels there so that you can rename and do some things there. So just to show you quickly how you can create a new meeting and add that label, let's click and create a new meeting from here and we'll just say that this is going to be a test and then when you're going to add that label to it you'll go down to your color coding dot at the bottom of this box and you'll click on that and it will give you your different label choices here or if you're in the full screen mode you'll go to the bottom left of the screen click on that color coding button and you'll see your different labels that you've got assigned here select and then when you save you'll see it will be color coded accordingly. So with that, until we meet again, another day, another time, another update. This is Gary the Google Guy, signing off.